if you're someone who wants to get a job as a DevOps engineer or if you're completely new to DevOps, you might be wondering, is coding or programming a requirement for DevOps engineer roles? So in this video, we're going to discuss if you need coding or programming for DevOps engineer roles. If yes, how much coding do you need? What are some real life use cases of using programming language as a DevOps engineer role? And lastly, we will see what are the best programming language you should learn as a DevOps engineer. So hey everyone, welcome to CloudChamp. If you're new, please consider subscribing. I post videos and share my experiences on cloud and DevOps. So please subscribe and let's start with the video. The first question is, do you actually need programming or coding for DevOps? The answer is yes, you will require knowledge of programming and coding to work as a DevOps engineer. And to prove this, you can check out any job description for DevOps engineer roles and you will find they are looking for candidates having programming skills or having scripting skills. But DevOps engineers do not typically need to learn programming at the same level as software engineers or software developers because DevOps engineers are not the person who are going to write the code for the entire application themselves. This brings us to our second question, how much coding or programming knowledge do you need as a DevOps engineer? When it comes to the level of coding knowledge required for a DevOps engineer, the answer is it depends on project to project and the company you are working for. However, as a DevOps engineer, you do not need to have extensive programming knowledge or you don't need to learn any algorithms. You just need to have a basic understanding of programming to do your everyday task as a DevOps engineer. That might be creating automation scripts or creating infrastructure on the cloud using SDKs or to integrate different DevOps tools. So in short, you just need enough programming knowledge to do your everyday task as a DevOps engineer. Now let's look at some of the real life use cases of how can you use programming language or how do I use programming or scripting for my DevOps task. So the first use case is to create automation script. Recently, I created an automation script for our database backups, which we used to do manually every day. So you can create automation scripts using programming language to avoid doing repetitive tasks. Second could be implementing monitoring and alerting systems using programming languages like Python or Golang. Uh, you can also use programming language to create custom plugins and extensions for tools like GitLab, Jenkins, using languages like Java, Python or Golang. Third would be using bash scripts to automate infrastructure provisioning and application deployment. These are some of the use cases of using programming language to do your everyday DevOps task. Now let's talk about which is the best programming language for DevOps engineers or which one should you learn as a DevOps engineer. The answer for this is there is no best programming language, but if you are someone who is new to programming and wants to learn, I would suggest you going with Python as it is very easy, uh, having an easy syntax and can be used anywhere. But you can also learn uh, languages like Golang or Ruby or Java, but preference would be Python or Go. So this was the video where I explained if coding is required for DevOps or not, if yes, how much to coding do we need and what are the best coding languages that you should learn. I hope this was informative. If you found this video helpful, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you and have a good day.